Uh, First Lieutenant Julian Holmes, uh, First Platoon Leader for Charlie Company 214. Uh, we were responsible for the, uh, the defense of uh, the Ford Operating Base Connolly here uh, in Nangahar. Uh, we're also the guardian angel uh, support for the, the TAC East advisors who go out and advise and assist with the uh, Afghan National Army mission here at this location. It's not bad. It's not bad. Um, I would say that things could be a lot worse, especially if we were hiking up uh, some of these mountains that surround uh, the base here. As far as showers, is water bottles and, and baby wipes. Um, as far as defects, I mean, we're eating MREs. These guys are infantrymen. Uh, they're, they're, they're used to living off of, off of minimal uh, resources to be able to survive. They're tough, they're adaptable. So uh, really, the fact that we have a roof over our head, sleeping on a cot, that, I mean, that's, that's awesome in itself. So nobody's complaining, I can promise you that. We try to keep the guys motivated. They're, they're extremely motivated. Uh, so humor is a big part of uh, what keeps people going and keeps people uh, uh, focused and, and keeps people high spirits. Um, football, everybody here loves sports. Everybody loves, they're creative. We don't have a football field out here, but you know, just in that little area where we throw the ball around is, is just a great morale booster. These guys out here who just construct games to, to do stuff and, and horse around a little bit, uh, it's, it's just a great morale booster. Um, but other than that, I mean, that's all we do for entertainment. Other than that, it's just straight business. We're, we're planning for the next mission. We're planning for the next day. And uh, we're constantly busy, so. I don't have a linguist telling me what's going on. I kind of just read body language the entire time that I'm out there. Uh, looking around, but the progress that I see just in the attitudes and, and the body language among the Afghan nationals and our, our TAC East advisors has come full circle from the first day that we've been here. Uh, the more times that we go out there as guardian angels and see the faces of everybody, they see us every day and they start to recognize us, we start to recognize them. They greet us, they've given us chai and and bread and all sorts of stuff out there tried to feed us so I mean they, they really have been welcoming in many ways and and even though I don't know what they're saying they probably don't know what I'm saying uh, there's definitely been a, a, a comfort built up between each other which can be you know a two-edged sword but we're always on our, to our on our toes you know but uh, uh, it's definitely uh, I would say friendships have been made and bridges have been built as opposed to being burned here